the NATO Council uh, took on this obligation with its eyes wide open, and NATO does not take on any mission other than to succeed. So we're here to help the administration, and we won't leave until it can be handed over to the uh, representatives, the democratic representatives of the Afghan people. And nobody should misunderstand the sense of purpose, the sense of identity, the sense of commitment of NATO when it takes on an operation. There were many people who said that coming to Afghanistan was mission impossible. Some of these are the same people who said to us in 1995 that Bosnia was the mission impossible. Uh, and yet Bosnia is a very different uh, part of the European continent today than it was in 1995 in the wake of a horrifying and violent war. Well, we've listened very carefully to the voices uh, of those who have said that bringing security to Kabul alone is not enough. Uh, and that is why only six weeks after NATO took uh, the leadership of ISAF, the North Atlantic Council, NATO's supreme governing body, has asked the military to give advice uh, on uh, how or whether we should go beyond Kabul to other parts of Afghanistan. Now, it was a huge leap uh, for this Atlantic Alliance to move to the other side of the, of the planet. Um, and as I say, we've only been here for, uh, for six weeks. Um, but the Council of NATO has decided that that is something that must be examined. No, we have asked the military to give us options about how. So what are they? Uh, well, the, the options can be to uh, take on the uh, provincial reconstruction teams as ISAF islands. It might be a progressive takeover of uh, the provincial reconstruction teams. Uh, we're obviously looking at uh, the nature of these uh, provincial reconstruction teams because all of them are different because they all relate to different circumstances. So, you know, we don't ask the military to simply uh, give us a blueprint based on what a number of ambassadors or a number of capitals say. We ask the military to look at all of the options based on their experience. And even on top of the ones that I've suggested, there may well be others that we haven't thought of. Uh, but they'll all be looked at, they'll all be examined. Canadian troops from Bosnia, and we said that the operation would take 30.